And the following day, we saw him again. This wasn't scheduled, it was a, an appointment that Baldwin himself made. And uh, we went to his apartment again at the Shelton Hotel that day. And this day was uh, perhaps the most glorious of all. We were with Baldwin for about 20 minutes. And I've often described it in the only terms I can as if you could ever imagine how wonderful it would be to be in the presence of Christ. That's how it was. The beauty, the love, the radiance, it was just heavenly for us. And we, we were there for, I mean, I say we were there 20 minutes, but it, for us it was timeless. To be with Baba is to, to somehow partake of the timeless. Uh, and uh, one sat on one side of Baba, two on the other side, and I just had to get near to Baba. So I sort of knelt in front of Baba and sat back on my heels. That was all right. And uh, right in front of his lovely foot, his sacred foot. <coughs> and, um, and I kept thinking, this is such a beautiful experience, such a wonderful experience. Oh, if we only had some little thing as a memento. And immediately Baba snapped his fingers to Chanji, his old secretary, and pointed to uh, a rose in front. And uh, Chanji brought the rose. Baba began taking the petals off and handing one to each one of us to keep as a memento. <laughs> he, he knew I thought, of course, we later realized that he, he, he always knew everyone's thoughts and feelings all the time. And he had a thing going with everyone, everywhere, all the time. <laughs> I don't know how to ask me how. <laughs> and uh, his lovely foot was there. And uh, I just had the overwhelming urge to kiss his foot. And that did. Come with one, get another. I never knew when I'd get another opportunity. <laughs> and no one seemed to notice, least of all Baba. But after a while, he drew me over to him and embraced me and kissed me on the forehead. And uh, the, the whole experience was so indescribably beautiful. He said, through love, you will come to see me as I really am. So this, in essence, was the first meeting with Baba. <laughs> Thank you, Donald. <Bill. laughs> we, we all have to you. <laughs> I can't help but think that those of you who've been to the Baba house in New York, do you know that the Stokes' house of what um, Darwin had been talking tonight and his experiences there. It only just across the street, you believe it, after all these years, when Baba went there, that this is the spot that the Baba, Baba house has chosen for them.